Hello everybody, welcome back to Delight Channel. Um, last week we landed our conversation on remember life life balance. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for all the feedback that we got, and I hope you are doing something about ensuring you find sync and balance to your life. And please feel free to tell others because I think that is one message everybody needs to hear. So this week, we are starting a brand new topic. And it's something that is very important. Something that is not given so much attention by most people. And therefore, it catches them by surprise. And like I keep saying, when something is important, it doesn't make any noise. It doesn't chase you because it knows that you cannot run away. It will be waiting for you. So what are we talking about this week? Well, what are we starting to talk about this week? We are starting to talk about retirement. Yes, retirement. Some people hearing this word now will go into panic. They will start fretting and if you check their blood pressure right now, shooting off through the roof. But some are also hearing and saying, wait a minute, I'm just 25, I'm just 22. Retirement is not for me. Yeah, that is why we are starting this series because it is something... That is not giving enough attention. In my mind, as I was preparing for this video, I was thinking it's actually similar to death. Most people, as certain as death is, they do not give it enough attention. If you're in that group, you better find Christ and make sure that you are ready to die because, unfortunately, it is inevitable. But let's come back to retirement. We are talking about retirement. And when we say retirement, what does that mean? Um... In simple words, retirement speaks about your withdrawal from your position or occupation or when you stop your active working life. The concept of retirement to this generation is very different from that of our parents. Our parents had pension, they had gratuity, they, there was a clear line between start and stop. But in this generation, for many reasons, one, because talents are very scarce, second, because technology now makes it possible for one to keep working way beyond what is the stipulated retirement age, and also because entrepreneurship is now more rampant. So for many people, retirement, in a sense, is no longer very clear. Some will retire from one employment to go and start up their own business and they like to work till as long as their health can carry them. And therefore, when we are going to explore this concept, we will not just talk about it from the traditional sense of retirement. We will talk about it from a very broadened concept, which speaks to the fact that retirement is a phenomenon or a concept that everybody needs to be aware of irrespective of the side that it is turned toward that is turned toward you you need to be aware that at some point you will have to retire what does that mean to you as an individual how do you prepare for that inevitable event and what can you do now irrespective of where you are to get ready and be prepared for it so in this series we are going to explore that concept deeper. We'll be talking about who should include retirement in their plan. We will be exploring some myths and facts about retirement. But more importantly, we will then dwell on what does it take to prepare for retirement? How do you really go about it? Irrespective of where you are right now in your journey, what can you start to do right now? How do you go about it? What are the traps that you need to avoid? What are the pitfalls that you must be aware of and stay away from? That is the menu for this for this series. And I'm sure you need I'm sure you need to hear it. I'm sure you also know somebody who needs to hear this. So, from next week Make it a date again on this series to be sure that you are not going to miss any of the content so that you too can be prepared and have a very fulfilling life as you start or as you are running or as you are about to end your active working life. So, make sure you make it a date next week. Until I see you then, don't ever forget, Timak is still my name, Dila is still the channel, and all we are trying to do is what? 
make a little difference. I hope to see you next week. Bye.